It's that time of the week. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to my channel. If you're always following me, welcome back, my beautiful angels. And if it's your first time here, my name is Adrian. I'm a psychic medium holistic wellness practitioner. And this is your reading for this week. There's one every week. So if it resonates with you, more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell, press a like, give me a comment. This is your general reading, same sex reading, same gender reading. You know, great, okay, great, okay, is <laughs> interesting, the LGBT, for those of you that celebrated Pride Month last month, I hope you had a good month, um, let's see what is your general reading, so if you want to, you know, this is your general reading, you take what resonates with you, oh, some of you need to chill, <laughs> some of you need to chill. If you want to have a personal detailed reading, 12 years dollars for 30 minutes downloadable reading. The special is continuing until the end of July 2020. Okay. If you want to have that, you're more than welcome to follow me on Facebook. You're welcome to follow me on Instagram. Um, if you want to know, um, if you want to check out my spiritual regression hypnosis, there's a there's a link in the in the in the down below to that will take you to my profile for that. If you're interested in an online session and there's a couple of videos over there as well that explains to you what I do and how I do it. And okay, put it over there. And getting a two more cards. How you all doing? 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 Mm -hmm. One more card. One more card for my beautiful babies. One more card for my beautiful, beautiful babies. Let's see what we got for you. Oh. What's going on now? Speak to me. Speak to me. We're listening. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Ah 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 babies. Ah 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 ah. Shh. Close your eyes. Open your heart. What is the message for you? There we go. What is the message for you? Open your heart to the message. Okay, and now there's one, two, three cards that came out. Okay, I'm going to pick them in the sequence that they came out. Let me just put this down here. That one was on top. There we go. Okay. Let's see. So we got the hanged man. We've got the nine of cups. We've got the three of swords. We've got the nine of swords. We've got the three of wands. Lots of threes, threes and threes, six nines, threes, you know, new beginnings, getting your foundation, getting your strength, your energy, your power, who you are, four of cups, six of swords, and I love this, the ace of wands. Okay, so there's the card that fell out. So, let's just draw your crystal oracle card as well. Some of you may have jumped into a situation quite fast. Something to do with love, something to do with faith, something to do with trust. Got your heart hurt, got your heart broken. And I feel that you might be looking towards a situation with somebody new now, but you want to take your time. You don't just want to jump. Communication, okay? You don't just want to jump, but you need to talk to your person. You need to know where you're at. Sometimes we feel that we don't want to let somebody into our space because we don't want to speak about it yet. But they may think that we don't actually care. Okay, so you don't want that sort of misconception happening there. Because now you're stressing in silence, okay? Looking at how things can maybe go wrong, new start, new beginning, and they're like, you know, I want to be with you. Let's do something together. Let's try this. And it's like you saying, yes, it can be done. But in the same token, you're like, I don't actually know. We're clarifying this ace of ones, and then cards just followed. What followed here? So another three of cups and a page of pentacles. Just because it's a reminder that just because things have been hurting you before um, doesn't actually mean that it needs to hurt you again. Okay, so, so this is a bit about having faith and having trust, not just in yourself but also in others. Because the thing is, when we don't actually trust other people, in effect, it's almost like we don't really trust ourselves too, because life reflects to us what we believe about ourselves. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What else do we have here? There's a card, what is sticking out here? King of Cups, okay? So, it's all fine and well to maybe have some hesitancy, see, hes hes some hesitancy, you know, 
wanting to take your time, needing a bit more time, but you need to communicate this to your person. Let's let's clarify this aquamarine, this communication card. I love aquamarine. Let's clarify this card because you need to speak to your person. You need to know, let them know where you are at. No? Otherwise, they may think that you don't care. And I mean, do you really want them to think that? Wheel of Fortune, Six of Swords. I just flipped around in the deck there as I was shuffling. Okay. So this communication can get you there and that, that can keep the boat floating because otherwise they may think that you're not interested. Who wants to have that sort of confusion going on? <laughs> Imagine this, you tripping on someone and they feel that you don't care. You don't want that. Also remember to go look at the reading for your actual zodiac sign as well. Okay. So in relation to this, you also want to look at that. Let me feel y'all. Let me feel y'all. Oh, really feeling y'all now. <laughs> Ace of Wands, beautiful brand new start. And then for the Three of Swords here, yeah, in the actual cards, two cards flipped out, the Magician and the Chariot. Okay, it's about being fair. When you... You can have your feelings, you can have your emotions, you can have your um, time that you need. But it's also fair towards the other person to communicate that. Otherwise, you know, it's almost like you don't want to be fair to yourself. And in the same sense, you want to be unfair to another person. So you have what it takes to find that magic that everybody can benefit. Okay. Use that beautiful intellect that you have for the greatest good of all. That's too many cards. That's a whole hand of cards that fell out there. Another card for the Three of Swords, please. Another card for the Three of Swords. For my beautiful LGBT family. What's up, my babas? What's up, my babas? What's up, my babas? I love you. You love me. We're happy. I'm alive. What a great big hug. And I'll put this one to you. Won't you say you love me too? Won't you say you love me too? Won't you say you love me too? Ace of Cups, won't you say you love me too, okay? Honesty, and, and when, when I say honesty, you want to be careful of little white lies. You know, sometimes you feel like if you don't say something, then it's a little white lie and it hurts nobody. The other person may not see it that way, okay? Or the other parties may not see it that way. Because now here yeah, with the Nine of Cups, there's things you're keeping you worried at night. You've got these emotions stripping, fighting yourself. Look at this car just coming out. Five of Wands, Page of Cups, Ten of Wands. Yep. Instead of silently tripping and fighting yourself the emotions, it's about stepping forward, claiming the emotions. Um, some of you are trying to sort of hide away your pain. You kind of feel that there's a, you know, that there's a strength in that. But it's about being open and honest about who you are. Nine of Cups, clarified by Two of Cups. Yep, that part that was missing, that you were looking for. This is how you get that. This is how you get that love that you were looking for. It's, oh my goodness. Two of cups, three of wands, and the sun. This can be so much better than you ever imagined. This is why communication is so important, okay? Two of cups, three of wands, the sun. What you want is there. They like you too. Let's clarify that the hanged man along with the three of pentacles. No, cards. Let's work with each other now. Why you went flying? So if you can please kindly go back inside the deck, the ones that flew out. I love you, you love me. I know that you very much wanted to give a message across to the family, but let's be nice about it, okay? Let's be decent about it. Let's be fly. Okay, six of cups. The office there. They love you too, they want to be with you. What do we have? Six of cups, knight of swords, two of pentacles. They want to work with you. They don't want to be left out of the situation. They want to know how you feel. Since we've got six of swords here, let's clarify this other six of swords. And then we're going to finish off with the four of cups. Okay. See what's going on here. What's going on? What's going on? What's the vibe? What's the vibe? What's the vibe? I'm going to draw you some extra cards also. I'm going to draw you some oracles. Or maybe I'll take this Osho deck that's laying right next to me because I love it so much. Okay. So six of swords, let's 
see what we've got. This message is quite straightforward. Queen of Wands, the wall. Three cards, goodness. So six of cups. Oh, the w this went on the four of cups. Okay, that's what I said. So that's over there, but then I need to draw one more card. Okay. And it went flipping right around. Okay, so. You know what you want. You know you'd like how to be. This is now the Queen of Swords and the Eight of Swords. Sorry, the Six of Swords. We're clarifying. So you've got the Eight of Swords. So some of you, and I'm just going to give it to you straight. You are seeing the situation. You are seeing problems. You're not seeing solutions. Four of Cups, the Hankman that we started with. We're ending with it now as well. Um, because the Hankman was the first card that I actually pulled out. The Hankman, the Four of Pentacles, the Four of Wands. So if you can apply some patience, what you think are problems can actually lead you to the unity that you want. Okay. I know that we don't always want to call stuff stuff, but for me, when that card comes out, there is something about marriage that is going on. It just is that way. Okay. Boom. Osho cards. Let's draw you some three of these beauties. I love these cards. Let's draw you three of these beauties, my loves, and let's see what we have. First one coming out, postponement. You see what you want to have. You can feel what you want to have, but you're not quite seeing it around you okay because sometimes we feel sometimes when we really want something and we're careful it's almost like we don't want to um open our hearts to the possibility because we don't want to be hurt okay. what's with all these cards that are going to the floor it doesn't have to be overwhelming intensity in reverse Many of you are overthinking the situation. You are overthinking it. You are seeing problems. Remember, you want to be careful with that because when you keep on seeing problems, you can manifest a problem that is not there. So you want to be careful with that. Okay. Yeah. Postponement, intensity, reverse, the creator. I'm going to draw you one more. The magic's already there with you. The magic is already there with you. The magic's already there with you. Playfulness. Just embrace life. Okay. Hope it helps. Wish you all the best. Have yourself a beautiful day. Remember, you also want to go look at your um, the reading for your zodiac sign. I wish you all a beautiful day, night, evening, afternoon, whenever you're looking at this. Blessings, love, and light. If it resonates with you, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Um, press that, what is that thing, notification bell. Um, give a like, give a comment, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Instagram. You can sell it for personal detailed reading. 12 US dollars for a 30 minutes downloadable reading. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you, love you, love you.